Back when I used to live in Leicester, I went on a night out once to a rock club with my friend Marek and my friend Laura. And she brought her friend along as well. Her friend was a nice girl, she used to be quite pretty, and then decided she was a lesbian and started reverting to the stereotype. She started wearing checkered shirts and she put on a bit of weight and she cut her hair a bit shorter and it was... It was a bit disappointing to see someone just go, I'm a lesbian, and then just go to the stereotype. She's at the club, and this girl's dancing away. This guy walks up to her and starts dancing with her. Now this guy, so you can get an image of him in your head. The only way to describe him is how my friend Marek described him, which is that he looked like a potato. Go get a potato out of your cupboard or Google potato. That is what he looked like. Me and Marek were like, well, first of all, she's a lesbian, so... Poor guy. Secondly, even if she wasn't a lesbian, he still looks like a potato. And then they just started getting off with each other. Well, like, hang it out. I know you've had a lot to drink. Why are you getting off with a guy if you're a lesbian? So anyway, potato man and fake lesbian are getting off. Night ends. We get outside. Fake lesbian has had a lot to drink by now. She pulls away and like does that to him. Like, One minute. She turns and throws up. Looks back at him and he starts getting off her again. It's like, no, she just she just threw up. What are you doing? Like, potato man, like, what are you doing? Like, I don't get drunk, but even if I did, I would hope that I would have enough mental capacity to realise that when I watch a girl throw up, the next thing to do is not to stick my tongue in their mouth. Now, you would assume that is the end of the story, but sadly it's not. The next day, I met up with my friend Laura, who lived and worked with this other girl, and she told me the story of the morning after where she knocked on her door to say, hey, come on, let's go to work. And she walked in and lying naked, face down on the bed was Potato Man, hairy and all that. And lying behind him was a strap on. Laura looked at her friend and her friend went, we tried to do it last night, but he was too tight. Just like how desperate are you that you get off with someone, they throw up in front of you and you still get off with them more. You go back to theirs and they say to you, hey, can I fuck you with a strap on in your ass? And you go, yeah, right. How, how desperate are you for human affection? 